Today, we're going to learn about timbre. By the end, you should be able to answer the questions, what is timbre? How is sound made? And why do instruments sound different? Have you ever wondered why a saxophone sounds different than a cello? The difference we hear between instruments or voices is called timbre. In order to understand why different instruments sound unique, we need to understand the basics of how sound is made. Sound is made up of vibrations that travel through the air. Our ears pick up those vibrations and our brain makes sense of them. Different instruments make sound waves that look different. The sound waves a tuning fork makes will look different than the sound waves a clarinet or a trumpet makes. Also, when an instrument plays a note, it creates not just one sound wave, but a series of sound waves. These are called overtones. In this example, a low C was played on the piano. But the overtone waves it created also made other strings vibrate. When you compare it to the same note played on the viola, the overtones are different. This is what gives instruments their timbre. There are other factors that play into an instrument's sound, like the materials they are made out of or the way they are played. Instruments are made of wood sound different than those made of metal. Strings make a different kind of sound than percussion. Our vocal cords are different from person to person too. This is why singers have unique voices. The big takeaway is timbre. The things related to sound that make one instrument or voice sound different than another.